We'll see what you think of this now. It's a throwback to one of those intense, high on action sequences of protagonists making their way to safety through secret pathways. But the danger to the head of state can be very, very real. The chief, chief executive of the country and security agencies in the country are not taking any chances. Well, a secret tunnel has been under the wraps for more than three years now that allows the Prime Minister to move without delay to the Sabdajang airport. Here's a full report. Even before he became Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi's security was a huge concern. And now as he prepares to move into Seven Race Course Road, no stone is being left unturned to make sure he's absolutely safe. This is where a top secret underground tunnel is being constructed to evacuate the Prime Minister in case of an attack on his residence. This has been the best kept secret of India's top security agencies for more than three years now. At the moment, we are at Safdarjang Airport and behind me is the airstrip. Now, this airport is used for taking off and landing of small aircraft and helicopters. This is used by VVIPs to take helicopters to different destinations. And as you can see that there is some construction work happening here. Now, this is the place which will be connected by this tunnel from the 7RCR. Now, this will help both avoid inconvenience through traffic and will also help in emergency evacuation of the Prime Minister. This one and a half kilometer long tunnel will connect the Prime Minister's residence to Sabdajang Airport and will run through Kamal Ataturk Mark, Golf Course and Sabdajang Tomb. It will end at the helicopter hangar at Sabdajang where it meets the ground. The ideal situation is the short distance which you have got. One and a half, one and a half kilometer, even less than three kilometers. <laughs> And when nearby, and uh, nearby we have got an open area uh, for uh, uh, helipad to helipad area mm -hmm. where uh, the helicopters are ready mm -hmm. to evacuate. The Special Protection Group and the Directorate General of Civil Aviation say the tunnel will not just provide a secure passage to the PM, but will also ensure that traffic on the road is not thrown out of gear by the movement of the PM's cavalcade. Actually, we have got a lot of expertise. DMRC, mm -hmm. Delhi Metro, mm -hmm. they have got very good expertise. Mm -hmm. They have got beautiful tunnels they have created. Right. They should be able to do it very uh, smoothly. With proper CMT, mm -hmm. crisis management teams mm -hmm. evolved, mm -hmm. and they can create a beautiful evacuation uh, team. Mm -hmm. It took us almost 10 minutes to reach 7 RCR from Savdajang Airport. But the Prime Minister's travel time will be much less due to no traffic obstruction on his route. But in an emergency evacuation contingency situation, the Prime Minister has to be transported to the nearest safest spot in minimum time and at a high speed. And in that scenario, this tunnel will prove to be quite useful. With camera person Parminder Sharma, Atar Khan in Delhi for Headlines Today.